This is how you develop healthy eating patterns and completely eliminate cravings. You do this and you will develop a lifetime habit of healthy eating behaviors and eliminate cravings. Hey guys, welcome back to 5 nothing 100 nothingcom I am Fug It. And it stands for the fittest underdog guru using intelligent tactics. Guys, I want to tell you about a little known system, okay? Once called displacement diet, okay? Dr. John Berardi, who has a doctrine in dietetics and a minor in psychology, came up with a system of eating or a behavior pattern that eliminates unhealthy food cravings, help breaks food addiction, and helps get you healthy so that you can reach your fitness goals, okay? So you know how when you start a diet, you have food restriction, you have calorie restriction, and you get all hyped up, you go out and buy the right foods you need, you have you know your last cheat day on the weekend, and Monday you're off to the races, you know? And uh, this is the day after Memorial Day, so Tuesday, so a lot of people I know are starting Tuesday this week since they had Monday to still go off the rails or at the very least detox and do some food prep. But this is a brilliant system that I've used with clients over the years that have had struggles with getting rid of unhealthy behaviors and help them to stick to healthy eating in a way that almost tricks you, tricks your body into craving the right things, okay? That's the displacement diet. So instead of telling somebody, hey, or telling yourself, uh, I can no longer have chocolate, I can no longer have alcohol, I can no longer have whatever, right? Those things that you really enjoy, the things that you just have tried over and over again to give up but just don't seem to be able to do it, okay? With displacement diet, you don't say no to any foods, to any indulgences. Instead, what you do is you start from here. I can have whatever I want to eat any day, every day, but first I need to do one, two, three, four, whatever, right? Now, the rules you follow is this. Before you put anything that is unhealthy in your body, you need to do these things. Have enough water in the day, generally starting with eight, eight ounce glasses of water, okay? Plus, so you're hydrating yourself. Have three to five servings of lean protein. So now you're feeding your body, okay? Protein is high satiety, meaning you're gonna be full on it longer and it's gonna nourish your body. And then the third thing is to have three to five servings of vegetables. Usually lower glycemic vegetables, preferably green vegetables, but vegetables. Now, you do those three things, okay? And some people say even adding an essential fatty acid like fish oil supplement or something like that. So you can add that as a fourth one. But at the very least, if you do those three things, sure the first day, you might say, okay, as soon as I get to the end of all of this stuff, I'm gonna have what I want and then you have whatever you want. The next day you do the same thing. I've gotta have my water, my protein, my vegetables. Get all of that in, right? What happens over time, which is why it was coined um, displacement diet, is it starts to displace the bad stuff. It doesn't make you say no to it or use willpower, but instead you use a system, right? You have an order of things. You stick to that order of things, little by little, you're hydrated, you're nourished, your body feels fed. Because your body doesn't crave calories, it craves nutrition. Thank you, Tom Venuto, who coined that term. All of a sudden, before you know it, you're gonna feel better, you're gonna start to look better, and when, you, when you're properly nourished, your body doesn't crave the bad things as much. Sometimes not at all. So, if you struggle, we're trying to stay on a diet, try to stay with healthy eating habits. I encourage you to try this system. 
leave me a comment let me know what you think share this with your friends that also have similar struggles this can be used in your support groups this can be just used in uh, whatever community that you tend to get encouragement from or share with that all have the same goals because hey it's just about summertime everybody has to wear less clothing because it is getting hot out and you want to look your very best for your significant other to attract a significant other and overall just in general for yourself and your own self-esteem so guys like share subscribe let me know what you think about that and i will talk to you again soon